guys, so today, um, I'm Allison. Today I'm gonna be doing my the 103 times O2 reaction slash review. So obviously spoilers, so go watch it and then come back and let's review together. Okay, oh my gosh. Okay, this was just so amazing and great. Okay, so um, just some things that I really liked um, off the top of my head and then I'll get to like the thing I really enjoyed. Um, I really liked how Octavia and Lincoln kind of um, not always forgiven, but at least they had some nice moments together. Um, I really liked how they got to see Nyko, um, Lincoln's friend. I thought that was really great because Nyko has been there for them for a long time. He saved Octavia. He saved Lincoln. He is, like, a loyal friend. And so for them to lose Nyko would have been, like, horrible. And I'm really glad that they didn't do that. And so I'm really glad they were able to save them. I mean, save him. And even though they went back to the place of horrors and went back to Matt Weather, I still think it's really great that they were able to save him. And I think it's a, I think it's a really good idea because you have all these supplies, all these resources. Why not use them? Yes, there may be, you know, yes, you're breaking the truce, but Lexa betrayed you and I doubt she would have kept her word anyways. Let's be real. Um, so yeah, I'm just really glad they were able to save Nyko because I love Nyko. And that was such a great moment um, just for them. Um, I'm also so glad that Monty got reunited with his mom. That was such a sweet moment. I was like, yay, Monty, yay. Um, it was really sad to hear what happened to his dad, but it was, I'm glad he got that because you need closure in your life. Um, when you go through a traumatic experience or you lose someone, not knowing is the worst thing imaginable and um it's just it's so nice to have closure and so I'm really glad he got that closure um I'm starting to see like where Pike's resentment is so yeah we got introduced to Pike he was a teacher in the arc earth skills and so I'm really glad that we got to see him because they're setting him up really well um we know in the trailer and right now that he hates the grounders for obvious reasons um the ice nation killed a lot of their people so he has some very real and very honest resentment against the grounders so it makes sense how he doesn't like them and just him being the leader of their group from farm station it makes sense how he's able to rally the people and get everyone just to listen to him he's very charismatic very um he has really good leadership qualities and he's very persuasive and his hate the grounders mentality and so yeah, that's going to be a big problem. I can already see that. But just, I'm glad they set up his character. And I like how they're, they are developing him. Um, okay, so I actually really liked the Murphy-Emery storyline. Um, I'm not a huge fan of Murphy. But I'm glad his friend, if you could call him that, Emery came back. I'm glad they were able to kick Buck together and escape from Jaha and his little um, cronies um, of weird people in the City of Light. Um... That whole thing is just mind-boggling. And how that dude came back to life in the City of Light. Like, holy cow, that's crazy. But it makes sense in the science fiction world. Um, so I'm really glad Murphy and Emery got to have some happiness. Got to escape, go off on the little boat together. Thought that was great. Um, okay, so let's get to, like, the awesomeness. The awesome scene that we experienced. Okay, so after, like, 360 plus days of waiting... Bellamy and Clark were finally reunited. Yes, I know it was short, but it was awesome. Dude, the feels were flowing. Like, so many emotions. Like, okay, so basically we know that Clark is being um, captured by this bounty, ho bounty hunter Rowan who has been banished from the Ice Nation. So he's basically saying, okay, well, if I take, if I take back Clark, I have a prize. So I have leverage to gain entrance entrance back into the Ice Nation. So I thought it was great how Clark was smart and I mean we always knew Clark was smart but never turn number one never turn your back on Clark like never give her opportunities to get weapons like she is smart and so I'm really glad that um Clark did not go down without a fight um like she was fierce and um I kind of liked their scene like between Clark and Rowan that they had because Clark's like we're both in the run we're both, we're both running from our people. Um, they had a lot of stuff in common. So it, it made sense how Clark was talking to Rowan like that. Um, so Bellamy is like, I can't lose Clark. Holy crud. Okay. So they're like, it's like Indra and their little gang are, are like running on this like, um, I mean, like on this grass or whatever, grassy plain area. And Bellamy sees Clark through 
the eyepiece of his of, of his rifle and so I thought it was really great how he was able to see her and he charges after her and then Pike's like no no stay and he was like I'm going after her which is awesome because Bellamy cares so much for Clark and I'm just I'm glad they're showing that I'm glad that they are showing that and not just brushing it underneath the carpet because it's been building up for two seasons now and it'd be foolish to not um I guess maximize that that just their just their friendship and their their pairing and so it makes sense and so I really like how they go back into the little cave whatever like oh we're up oh we're just gonna chill and then like Bellamy escapes which I kind of predicted this super happy I got this right so he basically like dons an ice nation gear goes after Clark he goes inside that cave sees her like oh my gosh like and just them seeing for each other like they show so much without saying anything like there was literally like no dialogue but it was you could definitely tell like they care for each other that's why I'm so happy like Bob and Eliza are just perfect for these roles you don't need words when you really care about someone and that's what Bellamy and Clark are they don't need a lot of words to express how they how they feel and so I'm glad I just thought it was really sweet how like Bellamy was like caressing her hair and they're just like ah and then Holy crap, Rowan jumping out. And then Clark's like, please don't kill him. Like, I'll do anything. Like, just shows how much Clark really cares about Bellamy and how she had to make a tough choice, but at the time it was right for her. And so for her to really say, like, I'll do anything, like, please do not kill him. Like, she really cares about him. And I'm glad, I mean, I figured he wouldn't die because he is, I mean, I feel like if you kill up Bellamy or Clark, like, they wouldn't be a show, just being real. And so I'm glad that. Um, they didn't kill him off. I thought it was sad how he still got injured, but it just shows how even when he was injured and, like, stabbed in his leg, bleeding, like, Bellamy was like, I can't lose Clark. I'm still going after her. Like, he's so determined to get back to her. And I just feel like that's just, that's true love. Like, throughout all the obstacles, all the trials, everyone trying to pull you apart and to keep you apart, it's real. It's just pure unadulterated love and I love to see that it was such a good B. Lark scene sequence it was short but it was great um one last thing I'm so happy so so happy that the Lexa Clark reunion was realistic I was really worried they just would like be like oh, oh everything's forgiven no everything is not forgiven I'm so glad it was realistic and Clark just calling her the B word and spitting in her face was just awesome. Like, Lexa deserves that. I'm sorry. You, you, leave, you leave someone for dead, betray them, mess with their feelings, manipulate them. You deserve what you get. Just being real. Um, so I cannot wait for the next episode. I'm just so excited. And I'm really worried, though, because in the promo, there's an explosion with Raven and... Oh, that girl needs a break. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this reaction. Let me know what you guys think. Comment down below, like, comment, and subscribe.